Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can use magnifier on the iPhone 14 series. First, swipe up at the bottom to go back to the home screen. And before you can use the magnifier glass, we need to add it to the control center. So to do that, first you need to tap on the settings icon. So tap on settings and in the settings screen, Swipe up to go down and tap on Control Center. Next, we go down and tap on Magnifier. Tap on the Add button to add the Magnifier shortcut to the Control Center. And then swipe up to go back to the home screen. Next, we swipe down at the top to open up the Control Center and open the Magnifier app. Okay, I'm going to go back to the default settings. So I'm going to tap on the settings icon and then tap on default. And this will bring me back to the default settings for the, ma uh, for the magnifier glass. Now, when you are using your magnifier glass, there are a number of settings that you can change. Um, for example, if you are quite close to the object that you want to, to use, you can see sometimes it can be quite difficult to focus on the object. And if I zoom right in, you can see sometimes it is blurred. So what you want to do is you can tap on the camera icon and you can choose close up. So with close up, you can zoom in and still maintaining the focus. Or you can choose auto and the phone will automatically try to change the lens depending on how close or how far away you are from the subject. So it will automatically try to lens, uh, to try to change the lens on the camera. So you can see here if I move it right in, I can get a quite a good clear. But if I try to zoom in and then it automatically switches lens and uh, the image becomes blur more blurry and I need to move my phone away from the subject. So this would depend on how close or how far away from the subject that you are trying to uh, zoom in. Otherwise, you can choose close up or you can switch to the front camera if you choose front. So I'm going to choose close up. And then from here, I can zoom in. You can also drag on the zoom bar at the bottom to zoom it right in or zoom it out. Okay, and down here, uh, some of the different things that you can apply it to your magnifier glass. So you can increase or decrease the brightness. That helps you easier, uh, that helps you easily to see what's going on with the subject that you have uh, zoom in. You can also take a photo and that's, so that's not a very good photo. I'm gonna cancel that one. And here I'm gonna try it again. So while taking a photo, you may need to keep your hand steady. And then I'll tap on the apply button. And after that, I can also apply a different filter. In here, I can apply an, a red filter, yellow filter, blue filter. I can zoom out or zoom in on the subject. And if I scroll across here, I can use the touch. I can tap on the touch button uh, to brighten up the subject. I can now uh, go to here. Uh, I can choose inverted or inverted grayscale. So I can zoom out. I can turn it that way. I can zoom in to the subject. I can move my camera closer to get a clearer uh, shot of the image. And what other, what other things that you can do is to, um, so I'm just gonna tap on that. Other things that you can do is swipe across and tap on the motion detection. In here you can detect um, people, you can detect door, and you can detect uh, image. So if I uh, point this one at the camera, it will say this is a pen, tablet, or uh, wood processing. So it detects some background wood right here. And if I place this one here, it probably say a watch or a clock. So you can see here it say watch. And if I move it right in, 
watch wood processing so it also detects the background has some wood process now you can tap on the end button to close detection and if i tap on the settings icon if i tap on the settings icon right here at the bottom i can also tap on settings and in here i can add in uh, say contrast i can uh, add in other activities and if i tap on done down here i can swipe across and tap on contrast and i can increase or decrease the contrast on my magnifier when i can tap on the add button i can go in here and view the object i can zoom right in and then have a closer inspection so you can see the writing on here is actually quite small you can't it's very quite hard to to read but if i use the magnifier glass I can zoom it right in and you can see if I turn off the touch it can be a bit hard to read but if I turn on the touch then that will um, add some extra brightness to the image and if I tap on the view button I can also continue to further zoom in uh, to inspect on the writing uh, on that. Okay, so I'm going to tap on end. If you want, you can also tap on the share button at the top in here. So after taking a photo, you can tap on the share button and then you can also save, tap on save image to save a copy in your photo library. And that's it. So that is basically how you can use the magnifier um, app on the iPhone 14 running iOS 16. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.